Hello everyone, Eric here. Today I'd like to showcase this 1971 Dodge D200 pickup truck. Um, I'm inside the cab of it right now and uh, we're going to start the walk around. So let's get right into it. Alright, this truck is all original, original paint. That's what you'd consider a, a survivor. Um, it's two wheel drive. Obviously because it's the D series, not the W series. The W series were four wheel drive and the D's were uh, two wheel drive. Now this truck, one of my favorite parts of this is it's got these massive mud flaps on it. So it just gives it that real classic farm truck look. Now. The bed is kind of a swimming pool right now. We've had a lot of rain. Got some good compressors in the back here. Here's 1971 grill. Um, the redesign for the grill started in uh, 1967. They started to redesign the grill for what would be three years. And this was the last year of the swept line 1971. Um, now, my good friend, I hope you don't mind me mentioning your name, but uh, my good friend Jeff, he's got a 1962 Dodge swept line. And uh, they really didn't change that much on them. They had little things that they changed here and there, but uh, one of the things that they changed were the tail lights and the tailgate. A real nice stout truck. And if you're wondering why they call it the swept line, it's because of this little sweep that they got at the end of the bed. Let's kinda let's follow that body contour. Right along all the way up until the front. I'm sure you're wonder, wondering what kind of engine it has. It's got a 318 Chrysler. All right, let's pop the hood. Oh, I get past the catch here. There we go. There you go, there's your 318. Don't mind the wrench sitting on top of the air cleaner. Um, yeah, it's a decent truck. This thing, it's got some good power. There's your compressor right there. It's also got the original radiator too. Um, look at that, it's even got the original tool stowage, mainly for your jack. Um, the fenders on these trucks are awesome. You could sit up on top of it and work on your engine if you need to. Um, I think that they made the fenders like this so that way it's easy to, to work on if you're, you know, in any kind of a crunch. But, um, yep. Come around to the passenger side. Can't remember, remember if I left this door unlocked or not. Yes, I did. Okay, got some extra parts in here. It does have the radio. And it also is a factory air-conditioned truck, too, which is pretty rare. It's got a torque flight automatic. Bench seat. Yeah. Take a walk around to the other side now.
There's your gauge cluster. Look at the condition of the paint up top, real nice. Here's your dome light, still intact. Spare's just chilling in the bed right now. Gotta make a mount for that. Here's your bin. This door always closes super nice. Bam. All right, now we're gonna do some detail shots. Okay, that's it for the walk around of this 1971 Dodge swept line pickup truck. Um, if you have any more uh, questions or comments about this rig, um, let me know down in the comments. And uh, I'll try and get back to you. Um, if you like this video, give it a like. And uh, if you want to subscribe, I'm going to put a little, a little, uh, my, my little logo down in the corner down here. Sorry about that. It took me a while to remember what it's called. And I'm going to post some other videos somewhere over in here. Maybe up in front of my face here. Um, and check those out too. But uh, I might post another video of this truck. But for now, that's it. So thanks for watching.